Hey guys, what's up? Um, today's video is about the anguished man and welcome to another spooky Sunday video. The anguished man painting around mm -hmm. as creepy. Said that this was owned by oops, a person named Sean Robinson's grandma and it was given to Sean Robinson 25 years ago, about over 25 years ago. And it, and the grandma said the painting was haunted, she told Sean Robinson, and which is the reason why she always kept it locked in her attic. She said the painter had painted the painting with his own blood, which is really creepy, and it gave her eerie vibes. And yeah, and he actually committed suicide shortly after finishing the painting so the painting i'll insert an image somewhere here you can see it has like orange red colors and the paint itself is blood from the artist and the artist committed suicide <laughs> and the grandma said she would hear like screams and cries coming from somewhere when, when she had the painting present and she saw a shadow man walking around or she like not like walking around she like would have sights of a man or shadows basically a shadow man you know what i'm trying to say like it's a man but it's a shadow of a man <coughs> <coughs> oh shoot am i getting haunted i shouldn't joke about that um, so basically that's a little backstory of the painting. It's creepy, painted with blood, and the artist committed suicide after, and now there's a shadow man attached to the painting somehow, and there's cries and screams coming from it apparently. And so it was kept in the attic after that because she was really creeped out by it. And then she, uh, the son took it from her, and they started noticing the same creepy things happening in their house when he brought the painting in. They would see screams, cries, and they would also have sights of the shadow man. His son and his wife would um, see it and his son fell down the stairs shortly after he brought in the painting and his wife, Sean Robinson's wife, felt someone as if he was stroking her hair while she was in the bathroom or something. But that's a little creepy, you know? A little creepy and same thing screams cries and they would feel like someone's watching them and the shadow man and so he set up a actual camera in the room I think he put the painting also in a attic of his house and he put a recording like he recorded what was going on because they would see like door shutting or closing or the painting would fall down suddenly when they were sleeping and like creepy things like something was living there basically and so he put a video up he recorded it at night to see if he could record anything that went like wrong or creepy or something unusual and so I'll actually link the video below because it's pretty creepy I'm not gonna lie and in the video you can see I think in the video you can see the painting just falling down on its own with no reason whatsoever and there's another part where he the room to the door where that uh, painting is automatically just closes like what thank you for disturbing my video thank you thank you thanks Keep hearing my door and the motorcycle okay so yeah in the second part of the video you can see the door closing on its own and I tried looking like I don't see any string and I don't see any shadow at the bottom of the door guys my house is 
haunted. No, I'm kidding. It was probably the wind from the window, like, opening it. Oh, that scared me a little. Okay, just a little. Okay, anyways. So, yeah, I tried looking, and there was no, like, shadow underneath where I could see someone, like, closing it or opening it. But you never know. You know, you could tie a string from far away and slowly close it over. But I highly doubt it. I really don't think that would have happened. And so, yeah. So, I'm going to link that video below. You guys can check it out. It's by the owner itself. And he's had it for many, many years, the painting. And he doesn't want to sell it. So, basically, that's the story of the English man. And I've decided... I'm only going to do the Anguished Man for this episode. For the next one, I will do the eBay painting, maybe. Okay, so it's a very short video, but that's pretty much the story of the Anguished Man painting, which is said to be haunted. So, well, it's a little scary, but I would like to see this painting. And it's kind of creepy, and people have said they felt very weird when they were looking at it and stuff. So tell me if you, like, I'm going to put a uh, picture of it and see... If it makes you feel weird, you know? There have been some stories where people have felt weird about it. Alright, so I hope you guys have a very short video about the English man painting and the spooky Sunday episode. And make sure you watch the video of the English man owner video of the paranormal stuff that happened with it. So that's about it. Make sure you guys like comment stuff below and subscribe thank you guys see you in my next episode and more videos to come this week bye